Hello friends. Today we are going to study simplified communication systems which comes under analog communication. Now for that we know that in simplified communication system there must be a source which is used as a transmitter and there will be a receiver which is used for receiving the transmitted signal. So now let us see through the block the simplified communication system first of all there will be a, a source so first of all we will write one block that is a source then to derive that source there will be a transmitter then a transmitter will transmit the signal using a wired or a wireless communication so we write it here as communication channel now this is a channel now we comes at a receiver side so here there will be a receiver and then finally this receive signal is converted into its original form so it is known as destination so this is just a basic simplified communication system now let's see that the source source is what source is any form of communication you want to transmit it through a longer distance so that will be our source so here source any form of communication which is transmitted into electrical signal because our all the transmitter circuits are in electrical form so here we will take it as input transducer so what it will do it will convert the any physical form of information physical form of information to electrical signal now the first aim of source whether it is voice or video or any other signal which is first converted into electrical signal so here what we are getting we are getting an electrical signal a transmitter now a transmitter it convert the analog or digital form of information signal suitable for transmitter transmission over a communication channel so transmit main work of transmitter is that it convert the analog or a digital form of signals or information suitable for transmission over a communication channel so now we let's come over a communication channel communication channel may be of two types whether it is wired or wireless communication in wired communication we require an electrical signal so electrical signal is transmitted through a wired channel but if there is a wireless channel then there will be an electromagnetic wave magnetic wave or electromagnetic signal which is transmitted through wireless channel so you must remember that in communication channel if there is a wired wired channel electrical signal will be transmitted if there is a wireless channel the electromagnetic wave will be transmitted now accordingly at receiver whether it is wired or wireless the receiver will work accordingly and then finally the signal which is received at the receiver has to be converted into its original form because at source we have converted any form of information to electrical signal now suppose our physical signal is audio signal the audio signal 
now audio signal converted into electrical signal at transmitter so at receiver there will be an output transducer output transducer what will be it will convert electrical signal into its physical form so suppose i have transmitted audio signal it has been converted into electrical signal then through a transmitter it has been transmitted over a communication channel according to the communication channel we have put a receiver and receiver it is will convert at the destination it will convert the physical or electrical signal in the form of finally physical form that is here audio signal so if there will be a mic through which we are recording a signal then here will be a loud speaker through which we are listening the signal so this is our simplified communication channel now in less next lecture we will see how this the noise affects in a communication channel that is our first chapter so thank you for watching please subscribe analog tech channel for more videos to come don't forget to subscribe it more videos will be coming coming up thank you friends thank you for watching